welcome back to another lip balm review. This one is for the Crazy Rumors Orange Cream Sickle. Hopefully it's still good because it's the older kind and I've had it in my collection for a while but still sealed so hopefully it's still okay. Um, I figure at worst it may be stale. It'll probably be fine. I think I've so far, Knockwood, only had like one real Crazy Rumors casualty so... That's not too bad, um, but I am trying to work my way through the older ones that I still have in my possession just, you know, to get them done because can't replace them now because they discontinued them, so <laughs> they have new flavors now, which are all fine and well, but the discontinued ones, I'm just like, oh shit, crash course now to do all the things, but anyway, um, obviously format-wise, it's a stick. Packaging-wise, we've got a little ice cream cone here with orange cream sickle on it. This one may be in their current lineup. I would have to go look. Um, actually, so let me look at a thing. Is it one of the ones I have here? I'm gonna laugh my butt off if I have another one over here. No, it's not. Okay. Well, it doesn't mean that they don't necessarily still make this one, because I feel like they might on this one. I'm not certain, though. So, anyway. Let us see. So. So far, so good. Everything looks normal. Let's roll her up and take a look. See here. I'm not seeing any warties. That's a good sign. I think we may be okay with the worst just being potential staleness. Yeah, it just smells like old wax. Okay, well. I can live with that. Maybe I'll get some of the scent out once I swatch it some and get it going, but for now, at least we know it seems to be okay, so. Anyway, these are natural, if this is your first Crazy Rumors review. Um, the stuff in it is macadamia seed oil, olive oil, shea butter, um, candle lila wax, soybean wax, jojoba seed oil, carnauba wax, natural flavors and or pure essential oils, vitamin E, and stevia. So. They are organic. Um, I guess you could say it's limited edition because I think this one's discontinued. Uh, like I said, I'd have to double check on this one because this one may be one of the ones that's still around, but I'm not certain. If it is, and if I really don't get much of a scent out of this even after swatching it, I may buy a newer one of it and do a re-review on the new version in contrast to this one. But if it's not, then I guess this is what we get. But anyway, so, it was part of the ice cream collection. There was, like, four flavors in that collection, but you could also buy them individually. I think that's what I did on this one, because so I think I went through, I got some of them, and then I went back and got the rest of them and realized I should have just bought them all in the box set, but I didn't. Uh, but anyway, um, the amount of product is 0.15 ounces, standard stick amount. Uh, shelf life isn't listed, but it's... 24 months after opening. Well, I just opened it, so it should be okay. Um, price point on these, I think, is $3.50 each, I want to say. Uh, either $2.99 or $3.50. It's one of those two. But I know they're not much. They're actually really reasonable for being an organic indie brand. Um, Sturdiness-wise, we do have a little bit of a wiggly turn wheel, but not unforgivably so. And the cap is pretty sturdy. Let's not drop it, please. And stays on pretty well, so no points docked for either of these things. Uh, no special features like SPF for medication, so let's do a swatchity swatch and see if we can get some more scent going out of this. Ooh, I just... That sucks. But let's try to rub it down now. Yeah, it just smells like old wax. That sucks. Well, I suppose we'll see what we get here. I have made a mess out of this poor little stick. Poor thing. I'm sorry, baby. Um, let's see. It's real soft, though. Yeah, it's like straight up just old wax. I'm not getting any orange out of that. Poor vanilla. I bet at one point... Probably. I taste orange, but I don't smell it, so that kind of sucks. Um, hmm. Let me check the website real quick, and I'm gonna go wash my hand here, 
and I'll report back. Oh, ho, ho, ho. so they do still make this one. So I'm think I'm gonna make a little note to myself to find some other ones that I want to just do a bulk purchase on and throw that one in there. And then whenever I get around to getting it, I will re-review this puppy. But for this one, you know, we can compare and contrast. But I'm sure it's a very nice one when you know it's not as old as this and lost pretty much all its scent. So it's just weird that some of them retained it and other ones lost it, which tells me this one may have been a lighter scent to begin with, uh, which isn't a bad thing, but I mean, with the aging process, it kind of sucks, but that's okay. That is okay. And I was right, they are $3.50 a pop, um, three, uh, free shipping at $30, so there's that. Um, as for the consistency and stuff on this one, that still feels really good. Um, I would say it's a sort of thin, thin thickness, um, but it's really, really creamy, very smooth and silky, not at all sticky or tacky, which I like. Um, it just feels very nice and moisturizing, a little bit greasy, but not in a bad way. It is very shiny from all the oils, which I also like. Um, they don't necessarily stay on very long. Um, I don't know if it's really different in the new ones versus the old ones. I haven't paid that close of attention. I know with the older ones, at best, even if I didn't eat or drink anything, I would get maybe an hour, maybe pushing it if I got two out of it before it was totally gone. But that's okay, because with this sort, it's because it's absorbing in more than anything, so it's doing its job rather than just sitting there. So there is that. Um, now, the drink test I'm going to go ahead and do here. And it did hold up to that. So, for whatever that may be worth to you, that's a thing. So, I'm just bummed that I really cannot smell this baby. Nothing. Nothing at all. Oh, well. Can't win them all. But at least it's one that they still make. So I can give it a second chance. <laughs> Just saying, I want to give it a second chance, because if it's good, I'd like to experience it in all its glory. I know darn well, I have seen all the summary emails from them lately, pimping this one out. So that's why I was like, I'm pretty sure they still make it, actually. So, I'm glad I was right, and I'm glad that it is attainable, so... Actually, if it's cheap shipping, I may buy it just on its own sooner rather than later. Maybe not today, since I just went on eBay and bought the new three-pack of chapsticks and the one single one that are Dollar General exclusives, because we don't have one of those near us. But anywho, um, when I give this the wow factor, I'm impressed that it's pretty much stayed good this many years unopened. Um... I wish it had more of a scent. I wish I'd known sooner rather than later if it had that scent, but what can you do? Um, but overall, I, I think, yeah. So, what will I rate it? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Well, because I don't know for sure if it's just the older formula or just because it's old. I am going to go ahead and dock a point on the scent just because there's no way of knowing if it was always like that from the get-go. But I will review the newer one as well. So it's gonna get a second chance review, guys. So don't get all butthurt if you have the newer one and you're like, oh my god, what are you doing? Chill. I will re-review it with the newer version. But this older one, I am docking a point there. That aside. That aside. Um... My only other potential issue, really, at all, is just they don't stay on that long. That's not too bad, all things considered. So I'm still giving this an 8 out of 10. It's still really nice. It's still usable. Even if you don't really have a scent for it. You know, they make unscented ones from this company, too. So, same difference. Still gonna use it and try and use it up quickly. And that's about all I have to say about that. So, anyways... Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you did, go ahead and give this video a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe, hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Did you guys have this older version of this one? If so, what were your thoughts? Did you think it had more of a scent or was it always just real light like this? Let me know. Um, 
as well as the newer one, and hell, if you had both of them, let me know how different or the same they are. Um, well, so anything else you feel like leaving me, make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything and more. It's all down below, and if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. So anyway, guys, I'm gonna go. Bye-bye.